Ever wonder why some patients struggle with low oxygen while others can't get rid of carbon dioxide? Let's break down the differences between type 1 and type 2 respiratory failure. In respiratory failure, there are two main types to know, type 1 and type 2. Type 1, or hypoxemic respiratory failure, is where the oxygen levels are low, but carbon dioxide levels remain normal. This happens due to a ventilation-perfusion mismatch, where parts of the lung are poorly ventilated but still perfused. Common causes include pneumonia, pulmonary edema, and RDs. On the other hand, type 2 or hypercapnic respiratory failure is when both oxygen and carbon dioxide levels are abnormal, specifically CO2 is elevated. This occurs due to hypoventilation, where the lungs can't remove CO2 effectively. Conditions like COPD, severe asthma, and neuromuscular disorders often lead to type 2 failure. So, remember, type 1 is about oxygenation issues due to VQ mismatch, while type 2 involves ventilation failure, impacting both oxygen and CO2 levels. Subscribe to 4DocsByDocs for more.